I think a lot of people were also shocked that um that I even won my thing. You can say that someone else should have won or whatever or, or yada yada yada. It's really counterproductive to the category to say X and X should have won, right? Like I think that it's a charity event. The fact that any this category even exists, that people did these amazing things, is to be celebrated anyway. And people getting annoyed saying it's fucked up that X and X won or someone else should have won. Even if I'd have lost, everyone in that category was a goat. It's so pathetic to see the audience kind of people get annoyed about it because I'm sure every creator of their own audience would, would be like, no, that's not the whole point. The whole point is of celebrating charity, not saying who did better than who, you know? And I think Jack is super fucking gracious. Uh, if Jack wanted to win the award, uh, all it would have taken was one tweet from Jack to be like, hey, uh, go and vote. But, you know, Jack never did that. I think I think Jack was also aware that he realized that I kind of wanted to go <laughs> win something too. I think Jack's a really, really nice guy. A uh, very humble man. He, he knew he knew if he wanted to win it, he could have won it. Jack doesn't care about that. He's a, he's a giga chad, bro. He doesn't, he doesn't give a fuck. One thing that I found really frustrating and and one argument that I thought was like the most, it's its like the most childish way of viewing it uh, was that I saw a lot of people who would say, well, X and X person raised way more money, so they should get it. And it's like, <laughs> is that all that matters in charity is who raised the most money? That's such a sad way of looking at charity. What a tragic way of viewing good things of like, assigning a monetary value or this great thing that a lot of people did. A lot of people like went out of their way, spent a lot of time, a lot of money to run amazing charity events to support a, a cause they care about. The last thing they gave a fuck about was if they raised more money than someone else. That is the most childish shit. Even if that argument had any, any weight to it, right? It's like there's different audience sizes. Does that mean that somebody else didn't deserve it just because their audience wasn't as big and the pool of people they had to work with was larger does, does that does that have any bearing on whose event was was a better event i think it's just a sad it's a sad argument and it made me quite sad i get it that people think that other stuff is like is more deserving in their mind i think that's totally valid you can think that a, an event is more deserving i, I just think that it's it's to, to kind of be public about it and make those comments is kind of sad. And so, yeah, it's, it's whatever. And I think also if we if we really want to get into it, there's different audiences. Uh, and this is like the stream rewards is like mainly a Twitch thing. So it's, it's no surprise that maybe a more of a Twitch audience would lean into it. I'm just glad that people are raising money for charity and I'm going to do way more this year. If I really, really wanted to promote it more on other stuff, we could have get more votes. But also then I feel that like, it's weird because it's like, it, it is a popularity contest. You have to do it if you want to, you know, uh, if you want to win, but also you don't want to shill too much because then people will accuse you of shilling like way more. Like we didn't mention anything on like Trash Taste. I didn't mention anything on my YouTube videos. I didn't want to do anything like that. I, I didn't want, I didn't want people to think that I was like shilling too hard. I think I did the right amount of promoting. I, I think so. I think I did a few tweets, did like, one or two community posts on Connor Dog. I didn't, and I, and I plugged it on the streams. Mouse helped. Yeah, me and Mouse helped. Me and Mouse promoted each other a lot. I'm really happy Mouse won. I really wanted Mouse to win. That was really what I wanted. I wanted both of us to win. Uh, I'm glad that people weren't mad that I won. <laughs> I was worried that people were gonna be like, what the fuck, he won? He won? <laughs> Literally everyone, and including myself really, had like written off the chance that I, I was gonna win anything. Yeah, a lot of people were just like, no, no shot he wins. 100%. <laughs> Why though? I don't know. I mean, it's just like you're against some really big people. I, I also would not have been like, again, chat, I would not have been mad if we didn't win. And Jack is the GOAT. I love Jack so much. Jack is such a talented and amazing guy. I, I hate talking about it because I don't like being like, <laughs> we message each other. <laughs> like, I feel like that's so lame. But Jack has been very, very supportive. Jack, fuck, am I saying Jack? Sean. Sean's a GOAT, man. I love him so much. He's so great. Having somebody who has just been in the game, uh, who just has your back is so nice. Dude, uh, there was so many sweet moments. You know, okay, you know what? Made me started panicking, actually. Me and me and Sean were texting. We were, I was like, are you coming? And we, we've been texting a bunch. He was like, I don't know if I'm going to come because he's doing a bunch of other stuff that's going on. And I was like, dude, you should come. It'd be fun. And I knew that if you had won the award, but you weren't coming, they'd make you record a video. Me and Jack didn't, didn't text like a few days before. On the day, Jack texts me saying, I think you're going to win it. And I was like, dude, this is going to be so fucking BM if Jack wins and he texted me this, knowing that he pre-recorded the video. I was like, this is this is gonna be so fucking BM. And I was like, there's no way, there's no way he would do that. Sean is way too nice, there's no way. And then I started freaking out, because now I'm like, oh shit, does this mean that there's a good shot I, I could win? So I started freaking out, and I was like, dude, what do I, I was like, oh no, oh no, there's a chance I could win, oh no. You know, Sean could troll me. <laughs> I, wouldn't have been, I wouldn't have been mad, I wouldn't have been mad if he trolled me, I would not have been mad.
Uh, he got in my head. Dude, imagine that. Imagine that. That would have been so cruel. It would have been so funny, though. I would have left so much, though.